And welcome back to 1011 News at noon. Joining me now from the Cal Humane Society is Matt. How are you doing? Pretty good. We're doing well. Oh, yes, we are. Who did we bring here? So we are in the presence of royalty today. So this is oh. Prince Charles. And he, yeah, how do you do, sir? How do you do, sir? Yes. But uh, he's about two years old, and we have him listed as a shepherd mix. You know, heavy emphasis on the mix part there. Maybe some Spaniel, maybe some Belgian Malinois, something like that. But he's about two years old, so he's full grown. So he's a nice medium-sized dog. He's about 37 pounds right now. He was on your lap during the break. He was. He was very friendly. Yes. yes. He wants he, to get uh, down and explore them. Yes. He, uh, he thinks he's a lap dog, so a uh, neutered male, and he came to the shelter as a lost dog, and surprisingly, nobody came to claim him, and which is really surprising because he's in great shape. He's also very Hello. smart. Somebody has obviously Come. spent some time training him because Come he knows on. how to sit and he Come knows on. how to shake. Come he kind of can do a little bit of rollover. He's got a little mm -hmm. work to do on that, but uh, very smart. Walks great on the leash, and so... He'd be an excellent pet or excellent excellent dog for yeah. a family with kids. Um, I think he would do really, really well in a family with kids of all ages and they can kind of have each other to hang out with and play with and go for walks and play in the backyard. And so, you know, if you're somebody that's been thinking about a, a dog and uh, you got kids at home and maybe it would be their first, uh, first experience with a pet, yeah. Prince Charles would be an excellent <laughs> choice. And so uh, with other dogs though, He's a little he's a little scared of other dogs, so okay. they have to be mellow dogs. And you know, for whatever reason, he just gets a little overwhelmed by uh, dogs that are a little more energetic. And so he prefers the more laid back, uh, okay. mellow types. And so yeah. maybe you got a senior dog at home that needs a companion. That mm -hmm. might be a good fit for Prince Charles. Um, but it's more of like just shyness in the sense of you know a kid going to kindergarten for the first day. Yeah, that's kind of what it is. So oh, I he's see. just okay. he's just really really nervous about it. But yeah, he's he's a good boy and uh, he's neutered and microchipped and got all his vaccinations taken yeah. so care of. So he's two ready. years old. So he's pretty much full grown. So yeah, yeah he's full go. grown. All right. What else is going on? So uh, we got our trunk or treat event, Tales and Treats. That's coming up on Saturday, October 12th out at the Pylock Pet Adoption Center. And that'll be from 4 to 7 p.m. And so that's a trunk or treat event for not only kids, but also for dogs. So get everybody dressed up in their best costumes and uh, <laughs> there'll be a costume contest. There'll be lots of vendors, activities for the dogs, activities for the kids. And so right around the corner, two weeks away. Yeah. And so registration is available on our website and uh, you can get the, the kids or the dogs signed up to attend, but adults are free to come on out. All right, that's great. So that's uh, coming up, like you said. Two and, weeks and from Saturday, two weeks from online, Saturday. Right? Yep, so registration's okay. online and so uh, if you register in advance, you'll save yourself a few dollars than if you register day of, but walk-up registration is also available as well. All right, Matt, thank you very much. If you are interested in Prince Charles, you can call contact Cal Humane Society at 441-4488. We'll be right back.